Hello, greetings to the Leos. Hi, this is High Priestess Jamila here to do your energy oracle reading from the energy oracle uh, deck uh, for the week. We're going to see what are the energies that you're going to have coming up this week. Now, the portals opened up today. <laughs> so uh, today is 7-7-2020 seven, seven, uh, when I'm recording this reading. And we're gonna, so we're going to do it for the week, 7-7 seven, seven through 7-14, okay? A lot of synchronicity with this with this reading as far as with the dates. Um, right now, we're still at a really chunky moon at 92% at the time of recording this reading. So here we are. Um, if you guys need a private reading or consultation, the link to my Etsy is below, as well as my Cash App information. Okay, so you guys can contact me either for readings, guidance, spell work, ceremonial work. Um, I do... Um, Sabbath rituals, and I've got things coming up for llamas, and so yeah, we've got all that going on. So, also make sure that you subscribe, though. Okay, appreciate it. Okay, so we're going to be using this beautiful deck, and I actually did a flip through of this deck, so you guys can go and check that out. Now, first of all, I am going to call to Saint Michael for protection for this reading because I feel like it's going to be some energies that are going to come out guys and I'm an empath <laughs> and you guys are empaths spirit guides ancestors guardian angels ascended masters for the Leos what do you see coming up 7-7 seven, seven through 7-14 seven, of 2020 what messages do you have for the Leos this week I'm just going to let it flow through. Mm, okay. All right. Thank you, Spirit. So I might throw five cards for you guys today. Ah, look at that. The attachment card came up. The hostilities card. Oh, goodness, Leo. The community card. This is good. Help and support is on its way. Definitely, you're getting help and support on this channel, Leo. We love our Leo the Lions. Oh, and look, the sun card. So things are going to get better. Things are going to get better. And a man holding a heart comes up. Oh, isn't that beautiful? So definitely, you can see some hostilities, uh, probably either because of success, recent success, past success, future success. Um, <clears throat> Leo, you guys have so much support, so much support in this situation. Don't be afraid to reach out, okay, because you're going to need it. Something revolving your love life. An ex, this is an ex that you guys are dealing with this week, maybe even today, or either some other type of negative attachment, and it is very hostile because you see the hostilities card comes up. So definitely can see some difficulty this week. Um, you may want to be prepared for that either today or tomorrow, uh, maybe even Thursday. But I feel like the community card, at the it, it represents support, a support system that you guys have. Now, whether or not this is with actual people, because some of you Leos might be very isolated because of what you're dealing with, you've got spiritual support. Now, the sun card is beautiful. That represents happiness and joy. So things are definitely going to get better, especially going towards the weekend. You're going to be feeling really good. The community card is very good. But for some reason today, tomorrow, and maybe even Thursday, oh, you've got an influx of bad energy. Um, somebody doesn't want to let go. Now, this could be a person or it could be a spirit. It could be several spirits. Many of you guys probably need <laughs> some uh, psychic defense. Let's see here. Maybe even parents perceive need 
and the choice to let go is what this card means. In the upright position, this card reveals that your passage forward, Leo, is being stopped by strong attachments to old patterns or people from the past. I really do thank this, the maker of this deck. So real, so practical. Okay, now the hostilities card. That's number 26. Um, aggressive energies, defenses up. Okay, you don't want to go too far in that. Okay, you know, stay in a good space. Stay in a good space. Okay, this week, Leo, don't get yourself in a negative space. Don't start thinking that the whole world is against you and blaming everybody and it's not everybody. It's it's exactly who you think it is. This person could be different for different ones of you, okay? Connection with kindred spirits is what this card means. This card shows three women celebrating, sharing ideals and supportive energy. The lights in the picture represent your ever, ever present spirit community as well. When this card appears upright, it indicates an association of some kind. It may be a casual connection of like-minded people. So you, you got support, networking, and community. The sun card. Okay, this is actually the first card. So definitely can see new beginnings are coming this week. Success. <laughs> With that card. Sorry, guys. I've been sneezing through. Uh, yeah, new beginnings and great creativity. Okay, and it may be difficult to pull that energy through, but you guys have got to do it. You've got to transmute that energy too. Oh my God, I've been doing it all day. I'm a Leo rising. This sun, the sun brings blessings to the earth. Okay, nurturing, personal growth, the birth of a new you, a time of great creativity. Okay, so your creative genius is going to be flowing, also representing abundant blessings. So those are coming this week, okay? Now, the, a man holding a heart, feel like somebody's asking for a commitment. Definitely a love offer that's going to be coming towards the 14th. Male dealing with family, love, or emotions. So I feel like you guys are going to have support of your lover. If you're a man watching this, they're going to be extremely supportive and strong. Um, this card represents, okay, okay, so this tender man sits with, sits with flowers all around, holding a heart in his hand. For a man, this signals a greater clarity about emotions and their purpose in your life. There could be a more balanced approach to family and love at this time, even if these Things have been bad in the past or confusing. So the person you've been wondering about, you, it, you know, I feel like they're going to be supportive. And so you're going through all of this and you are going to have success. And you guys know why you've been going through this. A lot of you, it's a new lover that your ex is trying to push away. And you guys are like, no, I'm not going to let you do it. And that's what I could feel. Um, and you guys are like, I'm not going to give up on love. So if it's not another person and you're single, then you guys are ready for love. This is a major energy shift coming up this week for the Leos. Okay. Now, if you guys need some guidance, I'm always here, especially with this situation. I do feel that many of you guys could, you know, call on some friends or call on some kindred spirits, okay? And if you feel alone, then, of course, you know, High Priestess Jamila is always there. So the link to my Etsy is below. Cash App info is below. Uh, for your readings, you can uh, cash at me at dollar sign psychic Jamila. Um, and we can get you scheduled for um, a reading. I also do provide... Um, as far as advice, uh, I, I provide video readings as well, Leo. So many of you guys are probably feeling a little 
sensitive right now. I'm a Leo rising. I'm not a Leo sun. So I can only imagine that many of you guys are like, I don't want to talk to nobody. So that's understandable. So you guys can actually go to Etsy and get uh, Oracle and Tarot readings. Okay. Either 30 minute or 60 minute if you guys don't want to talk. See you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you guys. And I'll see you later.